Ramadan Kareem. It is now the month of Ramadan. Congrats to all of you who have made it to this blessed month. Uh, Ramadan is a time of us trying to connect more to our religion and to Allah. And I know this month can be very tough on some people. So I am going to be here advising you based off of my personal experiences. This is Moshe's do's and don'ts for Ramadan. Let's get it. Number one, sahur. Most important meal of the day and you have to get it right. But some people, however, overthink it and overdo it and try to create a feast. And feasts take time. And time is not on your side. Pretty smashing this yeah, burger. Yeah, bro. Let's, let's, get get it. It. let's get it. Uh, let me get something. Are you serious, man? You missed. Bro. Hey, <laughs> man. What are you doing, bro? You're ending. Yo, yo, you can't. Say Don't that. overdo sahur because, like I said, time is not on your side. Moving on. When the month of Ramadan comes by, a lot of people are just focused on sahur that they forget about brushing their teeth. And for the rest of the day, their breath is disgusting. So yeah, we walk up to the, to the lake, to, yeah. the, to the kayaking place. Yeah. And he pulls up a kayak, right? Uh-huh. And we get in the kayak. <laughs> Yeah, so I go. How's it going? Good. So yeah, we get in the kayak, and literally yeah. ten seconds in, I I overdo it, and I flip all the way over. Mm -hmm. It was crazy. Yeah. It was crazy. Oh, you you know what would be really yeah. cool if, if you like pulled it up on your phone right out. Yeah, sure, man. Pull up those pictures. My, my brother uh, took pictures. Yeah, yeah. Please pull up those pictures. Thank you. Yeah, it was amazing. Take your time. Yo, here's a picture, man. Yeah. Look at me, all drenched. Oh, dude, that's cool. Oh. What's up with the, uh, hmm? yeah, the gas mask? What is it? What's yeah. going on? I've always had this on, man. You didn't notice? I've always had this on. Really? Yeah, yeah. Just tell me the story. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, it's just like, yeah, I, I overdo it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I got drenched, right? Mm -hmm. my, uh, my so, don't butt. forget about brushing your teeth. Please, I am begging you, for the sake of me and all of mankind. Now the third thing I want to talk about is a mistake that people keep on making while they're fasting a day of Ramadan, which is grocery shopping while you're fasting. You're hungry and you're thirsty and you're going to be buying a lot more than you need. Oh my god, all the food. Yeah. shopping while you're fasting. Now, when the month of Ramadan comes by, you'll see a lot of people becoming really religious, which is not really a bad thing. But you'll see a lot of people turning into their own religious scholars, and they turn into the... Hello, police coming through! Move out the way! We're better than you! Hey, you got talking girls, because no one likes the Haram police. Now, for most people, if thought time is the best time of the day because we get to break our fast. But some people, however, turn from humans to crazy people. So if you're late leaving Maghrib to go get food, R.I.P. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Bro, I can't wait to be eating that hummus right now, dude. I know, right? Especially when we dip it with some finafel. Ooh, that's so good. Fuck! 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 Fuck!
So don't be slow going to the food. Another mistake that people make a lot during the month of Ramadan is getting too much food and not being able to eat it. Ready to smash this food. If he does it again, dude. I'm full. I'm full already. I don't think I can eat this food. What are you doing with that? Uh, I threw away my food. You threw away your food? Yeah, I was full. You think you can take it for granted? I'm sorry. I you think this is free? I couldn't eat it all. I cooked. I spent five hours cooking. I'm sorry. I no, I was mama. cooking. <laughs> you deserve it. No, this. mama. <laughs> so don't put too much on your plate because you're going to waste the food. Moving on to the next thing. People eat a lot of gassy food during Ramadan when they're breaking their fast. And that's going to be a big problem when you have to pray Talawiyah for the next hour and a half. Allahu Akbar. My stomach, what? Oh man, it hurts. Oh, oh he's about to send him. I can hold this fart in. Come on. Come on. I, 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 come on, come on. Hold it in. Oh, it hurts. Oh my God. I can hold it in, man. Come on, keep it together. Oh, he's almost done. Two seconds. Come on. Come on. Don't release the fart. Come on, keep it in. Come on, you can do it. Come on, you can do it, man. Oh, no. <sighs> no! What? You take way too long! What? You take way too long, man! I fired it! So make sure you're not eating any gassy food because that's gonna suck later. The last thing you'll see a lot in many masajid is people trying to speed through Talawiyah, trying to get like the whole Quran done in one night and people are just trying to catch up to the Imam. Now that was all of it guys, those were all my motions, do's and don'ts for Ramadan. I hope you guys learn and apply this to your Ramadan. And have a happy Ramadan, a uh, merry Ramadan, and a happy new Shawwal. Oh,